Hello, this is Dr. Lorenz. Good afternoon. I hope you're well. Uh, Longevity Health Institute here, bringing you the best in integrative, functional, personalized medicine. Um, so, you know, we always are doing uh, proactive prevention and wellness, and you've heard me talk about this before, but your gut health and your gut uh, flora and your microbiome of your gut um, is essential to your health. So I know you've heard about this because it's all over news, media, um, you know, the uh, uh, food industry has is, is tackled this with probiotics and slapping uh, um, good flora and good bacteria into things um, you know, like yogurts and kombuchas and uh, uh, fermented foods and that, which are all wonderful things, um, but sometimes they don't hit the mark. But here's the key thing is our six point model here where we look at systems approaches physiologically um, in our wellness approach and when we're solving your problems and getting you um, well and getting you healthier, 70 plus percent of your overall immunity is your gut health, your microbiome, your flora in your gut. You are, and science shows this, you are more bacteria in your body, in your gut, okay, than cells in your body threefold. So we are billions and billions and billions of bacteria in our gut. Okay, and this creates a very strong, large immunity. And unfortunately, with age, medications, stress, poor diet, <clears throat> excuse me, gluten, high sugars, alcohol, um, and others, it can depreciate and kind of uh, damage your overall gut flora. And so, your good bacteria, your good flora, gets broken down. Okay, and then your bad guys win your bad guys start to grow, okay, and overpopulate. And then you can produce more yeast, etc. And you can develop things that are common like irritable bowel syndrome or SIBO, which is a new kind of condition that's been recognized, small intestinal bowel overgrowth, you probably heard me talk about. And all of these things can contribute to bloating, heartburn, um, indigestion, um, uh, diarrhea, constipation, irregular bowels. And new studies even show weight gain Okay, um, your microbiome does affect your metabolic rate. It affects your liver, it really affects everything. In fact, when I, I tell patients here, um, when they come and they've been with us sometimes months and sometimes even a year or two because of significant medical problems, I mean real chronic uh, decades and decades of medical problems, it can take us a year or two to get them back on track and get them well and get their goals met. We always, always go back to and are working on diet and gut health and their gut flora and literally the villi and the connection at their gut um, epithelium in their stomach because that's their immune system, that's their immune barrier. And what's happening at that cellular junction is critical to health, cancer prevention and autoimmune prevention and higher immunity to fight infections, okay? So it's key to life and key to wellness and prevention and longevity. So super, super important, of course. So let me talk to you about a study that came out in Nature medicine just this July, kind of due to athletic performance, but I want to show you because, or, or discuss with you, excuse me, something about one particular bacteria and, and a bacteria often that we use here that actually makes that good bacteria grow, but they sh showed in human studies and they also showed it with, with, excuse me, with Boston marathoners and they showed in mouse um, animal studies that um, this particular bacteria enhanced performance, okay? So absolutely, there's evidence now, um, and not as a joke, like uh, um, performance-enhancing drugs, PEDs, uh, that are, are a big issue in, in sports and in professional sports, et cetera. But that at potentially now your gut bacteria not only can help you with weight loss and feeling better and being healthier and having a higher immunity, but that it is super, super important in actually your athletic performance and in recovery, and this is why. This particular bacteria, bacteria, excuse me, Valinella um, atypica, is one that actually helps you convert lactic acid to propanate. So at the villi, at the junction in your small bowel and in your gut, it actually can help the conversion um, of certain um, lactic acid molecules to uh, propanate, which then you get less, um, <clears throat> excuse me, you get less, essentially, um, uh, muscle soreness, uh, uh, you get faster recovery. And in the study that was actually produced and actually um, uh, published, by the way, in New England Journal of Medicine and in Nature 
uh, medicine, uh, just this July, it showed that actually um, ath uh, athletic uh, performance was enhanced in mice, and it was actually uh, enhanced in Boston marathoners. And there's a high suspicion that actually potentially even the, when you produce more propionate because of this bacteria, this gut bacteria, that you will actually um, en enhance performance. Um, and I would even surmise that you enhance recovery. So here is more evidence about the big, big, big influence on your gut bacteria, your microbiome, um, eating well, getting off of processed foods, eating a whole diet, a blue zone diet, more of a plant-based diet, but you know, healthy proteins, get off of processed foods, get off of dairy, get off of gluten, okay? But take good quality probiotics enhance your microbial um, balance because it's gonna help so many things. And why would you need this? Well, simply just because the evidence is starting to show too that just this, this just happens with just with aging. You're gonna lose gut flora by just natural, um, evidential, even healthy aging, okay? So pro probiotics are essential in life. A good quality medical grade probiotics, we often use a company uh, that's um, called uh, uh, Zymogen. They're a medical grade company. They do third party testing. You can get them on our website. Um, it's one of the main probably 10 companies that we use here in the practice. Um, I also use Orthomolecular for probiotics. Um, uh, I actually is, I'm manufacturing a few of my own probiotics um, and we're in the uh, sourcing part of it right now. But I wanna share with you too, related to this study, not just any probiotic, but again, this Venlanella atypica is very important. Now that's a very hard strain of a bacteria to get, but you can enhance that, okay, by just in general, all more, taking more probiotics, uh, and, and quantity and quality are important, believe me, they're very important and key, okay? But also by taking this certain probiotic called Saccharomyces boulardii, not only has that been proven to reduce yeast, and I've talked about this in another video, but it actually helps this bacteria produce this atypical bacteria that then helps you convert lactate um, or lactic acid to propanate and can help athletic performance. So very, very, very important and key. So why don't you eat better? <laughs> why shouldn't you take a probiotic, especially if you're trying to lose weight have a higher immunity, and if you're an athlete, even an amateur athlete, can en enhance athletic performance. I think that's super key and more evidence about the importance of, of a good gut and a good microbiome. So hopefully this enlightens you and educates you. Um, always working on a point system here, and one of the main ones is your gut health here at Longevity Health Institute. Um, I'm Dr. Lorenz, be well.